Hello, my name is RD and we are going to solve problem 3.3 from Sadiku book. So the question is find the currents I1 through I4 and the voltage V0 in the circuit of figure 3.52. So this is the figure and we are given this is as our ground. And we only have one node here which is this node V0. Okay. And let's assume the direction of the current. We have given I1, I2, I3, and I4, which is all going down. And for the branch that contains current source, I just assume the direction is following the arrow of the current source. So I will have this going up and that is going down, right? And I think the first thing that we can do is to find out V0 by using KCL at V0. Let's do exactly that. KCL at node V0. Okay, what does KCL say? KCL said the sum of the current that goes in will equal to the sum of the current that goes out. The only current that goes in is this 8 ampere. So I will have 8 here. And then we will have that equal to all the currents that goes out. So I will have I1, I2, I3, and I4, and also 20 ampere. But I want to write it in the form of V0, right? So this branch here, I will have V0 minus this node here which is zero and the resistance between them so i will have 10 and we can repeat all the process so i will have v0 minus zero divided by 20 so i'll have v0 minus zero divided by the resistance between them so that will be 20 and then this current here is also v0 minus zero but the resistance between them now is 30 okay and then this branch here is just 20 so i'll have 20 here and for the last branch i think i need to move it slightly to the left because i ran out of space yeah okay good this branch here is v0 minus 0 divided by the resistance between them but this time that will be 60. okay i think that's good and now what can we do is we we get rid of all the denominator i think we can multiply both sides by 60 right so on the left hand side i will have 480 and then 10 and 60 will cancel into 6 and we multiply it by the numerator. But the numerator is just V0 because V0 minus 0 is just V0. So I will have 6 V0 here. Again, using the same logic, 20 will cancel into 60. So I will have 3 and then V0 minus 0 is just V0. So I will have 3 V0. And then we will have this voltage here 30 and 60 will cancel into 2 so i will have 2 v0 minus 0 is just v0 okay and then this term 20 multiplied by 60 and that will be 100 and 1200 and then 60 and 60 will cancel each other so we leave it with v0 that's good and now let's just add them up 6 plus 3 is 9 9 plus 2 is 11 11 plus 1 is 12 yeah i think that will be 12 480 is equal to 12 v0 plus uh 1200 Okay, I think we can divide both sides by 12. So I will have, what is this, 40. And that will be V0. And we will have 100 here. Good. And now 40 minus 100 is equal to V0. Or minus 60 is equal to V0. 
therefore we get our v0 v0 which is minus 60 and what is the unit because this is in ampere and this is in all in ohm so the unit here will be four and i think we got our first answer here v0 is equal to minus 60. okay now what can we do we apply kcl to find out i1 i2 i3 and i4 because we already have v0 okay what is i1 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 is v0 minus 0 divided by 10 so v0 is minus 60 then minus 0 divided by 10 so we will have minus 60 divided by 10 that will be minus 6 ampere that is i1 now let's do again for i2 that will be v0 minus 0 divided by 20 that will be minus 60 minus 0 divided by 20 that will be minus 3 ampere i3 okay what is i3 v0 minus 0 but divided by 30 v0 minus 0 divided by 30 now we will have minus 60 minus 0 divided by 30 that will be minus 2 ampere then what is i4 that will be v0 minus 0 divided by 60 so i will have minus 60 minus 0 divided by 60 that will be minus 1 i think minus 1 and the unit here will be ampere and i think we get all the answer here i1 is minus 6 ampere so this is i1 and then i2 is minus 3 ampere so this one and then i3 is minus 2 ampere this one and then i4 is this one okay, we got all the question from the problem so find the currents i1 through i4 right so we get all this in yellow and v0 is in gray here so i think we got all covered okay let me know if i made any mistakes in this video thank you for watching see you in the next video bye bye